pay up, Mortimer? I've won the bet. Here, one dollar. <laughs> oh, it's OK. Perfectly useless psychopath like Valentine and turned him into a successful executive. And during the same time, we turned an honest, hard-working man into a violently deranged, would-be killer. <laughs> now, what are we going to do about taking Winthorpe back and returning Valentine to the ghetto? I don't want Winthorpe back after what he's done. You mean keep Valentine on as managing director? Do you really believe I would have a nigger run our family business, Randolph? Of course not. Neither would I. I do think we should hold off on switching them back, though, until we get that crop report New Year's Eve, don't you? Absolutely. No sense rocking the boat until then. If uh, Mr. Beeks does what we paid him to do, we should have a very happy New Year. Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> Beaks? Are you there, Beaks? I'm over here. It's far enough. Uh, did, did, did you get the report? I see the money. Okay, toss it over. Thank you, Briggs. Wonderful news. Wonderful. Beaks. Happy New Year. After calculating the estimates from various orange producing states, we have concluded the following. The cold winter has apparently not affected the orange harvest. <laughs> Get back in there at once and sell, sell! But I, I, I just, I... I... Five? Yeah, two hundred. Hey, hundred? Oh, yeah, that was a hundred. A hundred? So did you get the hundred? Five. 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 Oh, that was a hundred lots? hundred? That's that, 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 Valentine. Hey, how'd you make out today? How could you do this to us after everything we've done for you? Oh, see, I made Lewis a bet here. He Lewis bet me that we couldn't both get rich and put you on the poorhouse at the same time. He didn't think we could do it. I won. I lost. One dollar. Thank you, Lewis. After you. Certainly. <laughs> Margin call, gentlemen. Well, you can't expect us you to... You know to... the rules of the exchange, Mr. Duke. All accounts to be settled at the end of the day's trading, without exception. You know perfectly well we don't have $394 million in cash. I'm sorry, boys. Put the uh, Duke brothers' seats on the exchange up for sale at once. Seize all assets of Duke and Duke commodities brokers, as well as all personal holdings of Randolph and Mortimer Duke. Right, uh, we're ruined. 
This is an outrage. I demand an investigation. You can't sell our seats. A duke has been sitting on this exchange since it was founded. We founded this exchange. It's ours. It belongs to us. My God. Mortimer, your brother's not well. We'd better call an ambulance. Fuck him! Now you listen to me. I want trading reopened right now. Get those brokers back in here! Turn those machines back on! Turn those machines back on! You and your Nobel Prize! You idiot! Where's Beeks? Where in the hell is Beeks? Beeks? Yeah, I forgot all about that guy. What are you doing? For God's sake, Akeem, do not take my pocket money. If you have no more money, you can cause no more mischief. You are being unreasonable. If you have ruined my chances with Lisa, I will never forgive you. Excuse me for a moment, please. What did you give him? Oh, I just gave him some pocket change. America. 